What's up guys, this is FOF Prototype here coming at you with an indie game um, rather than your regular large title games such as League of Legends, World of Warcraft, etc. etc. Um, the game that I will be showing you guys today is Indivisible. It's a prototype. Um, the game is not in alpha, it is not in beta. Uh, it still needs funding, so there will be a link below where you can go fund it. Um, and in that link, you can also download the prototype for this game. Um, it's a Lab Zero game. It's an action RPG. Um, and let's see. The overview of the game is Indivisible is a side-scrolling RPG in the vein of Valkyrie Profile, spanning a huge fantasy world inspired by our own world's various cultures and mythologies. Players will navigate beautiful environments using a variety of different traversal abilities and engage monsters in fast-paced combat. Uh, so from what I've seen, it's a side-scrolling action RPG. It's not like World of Warcraft it's not like, um, what's, it, what's that other game? Final Fantasy, um, where it's turn-based. The, the fighting sequences are turn-based. Um, it's a bit different. So I'm going to be using a 360 controller, uh, which it does have me actually configure as once you open the game. And it recognizes that it's a 360 controller, which is fucking awesome. And I'm going to start it. And it goes right into the game. So I do have it set up exactly Rody, how wait. it looks when you first start it. Uh, X is... Or button 1 is A, and then going clockwise it turns into button 2, 3, 4, and then... Not enough. So, real quick, I'm going to turn that down. Uh, I think I'm actually going to turn this off. There we go. Yeah. I'm not really a big pers person when it comes to listening to music in video games. I don't know why. It, it, just, it doesn't set the mood for me. I'd prefer to listen to more uh, copyrighted music that you guys can't listen to while I'm recording this. So I have been able to play just a small little tiny bit of it. Um, my other recording was screwed up. So, but it was only about two minutes long. I'm um, probably about as far as I was last time. So, it's pretty simple. My attack button right now is my X button. My block button is my Y button. And then jump is A, and B is absolutely nothing. So there's nothing that way if I remember. And switch targets. Oh yeah, so you can press, press left or right whenever you're not fighting to switch the targets. Yeah. Um, this little bar down here, I'm not really sure what these are for. At some points, it does seem like... <clears throat> excuse me. Like they are there to... Alright, kind of like a stamina bar, it, it appears to be. Um... I'm ready, Ajna. There we go. Oh, and now we have someone else in our party. Whatever. Just gonna jump. Alright, yeah. one. That other attack off. Um. Now, it's not like. Holy shit. It's not like, um. Like I said, like Final Fantasy, where it's a turn based game. Because if you just stand there and let them attack you, they are going to attack you, and they will kill you. Uh, I don't think I needed to go this way, actually. So. But. It's, like I said, also not like World of Warcraft, in a sense where it's 100% you get to choose um, when and what you do. Uh, okay, oh yeah, that's for like a special ability, which I don't want to use. I'd rather save it for my health. <laughs> Whoop. 
Ah. There we go. Alright, now I'm up the wall. I'm gonna jump around over here. Uh, I can go through there. But in the next fight, I will show you exactly what I mean. Um, as far as if you just stand there, they will attack you. So, I'm not going to do anything. See, they're just going to start attacking me. Uh, technically, it's their turn just because they're in the middle of an attack. But I do get to go. Oops. When my stand is up. I'm pretty sure that's what that is on the bottom right. That's 100% my stamina bar. That gets that's the deciding factor of whether or not I can attack, how many times I can attack, and etc. Et so like now I can attack again. I can attack with him, and I can attack with her. Uh, Zebi, Zebi, and I'll attack twice. Awesome. Do that real quick. Pretty easy. Uh, wait for that stamina to go up. Gonna block that. And they both get two attacks again. So. Which. I will not need her second attack. Ow. That actually did quite a little bit of damage to me. Get my attacks off as quickly as I can here so that I can start regenerating my stamina here. You're not gonna do enough damage to me. Right I will do enough damage to you. Oh no, I won't do enough damage to you. Yeah, I guess it's really not interesting. I have no idea what the actual damage output is. Um, I don't see like an item system here. Uh, the leveling system does seem pretty self-explanatory. Uh, the more- Ooh, I have another person with me, alright. The more you have the up... The more you level up... Um... So far, it seems the more you level up, the more attack you get off each turn. I guess really isn't that bad of a thing. Wow, this one is taking a lot of damage. Um, so we're actually going to take the darker one down first. Because uh, one less person that's going to be able to attack us. Seems legit, doesn't it? Yeah. going to attack with you, attack with you, attack with you, attack with him again. <laughs> And then attack with you, and then attack with you. I'm not sure why it's not attacking us, but... Oh, wrong person. Cool. So I actually have to have some pretty decent... Uh... Button 2, which is my X. Ah. Cool, yo. But, uh... I, I actually have to time my blocks, which is interesting to me, because I think the last game I played where you had to time your blocks uh, very well, which was a long while ago, um, Prince of Persia, which I think was for the 360, and man, it gave you years before you had to actually block. It was amazing. It'd be like, okay, we're going to attack you now. Are you ready? If you're not ready. Get ready. Are you ready now? Now. How about now? Okay. No. Oh. All right. Well, just do me a favor. Block. All right. Bye. <laughs> that, that was that was it was seriously the most annoying thing ever, because it just made the game so simple. Um, also falling off ledges, and etc, cetera, etc, cetera, but I mean, it, realistically, it wasn't that bad of a game. Um, I do like the principal game. Uh, just at the time, it was not particularly my favorite game. Right on. Bam, bam! Double attack your ass. 
Oop, I didn't block in time. Let's just hurry up and try to get these ones out of the picture. I blocked with the wrong person. I got it with the right person that time. Attack you twice. And attack you twice. What do you want? Alright, we got a fourth person with us now. And we are out of that little area there. So it seems like this is the thing, little thing there that we're trying to catch. Uh, can I go up there? Whatever. Apparently it doesn't seem like I could go up there. Those are very large bowls of rice. So we're gonna attack all of them. Just waste all of their mana on a couple of little itty bitty guys here. That gross. Block with her. Pretty fucking awesome. I can say so myself. Oh, nope. But it's actually a little bit more difficult than it looks to block with the appropriate character. Um, just because when you first start, uh, any button will attack. And then, any button will attack for the main character, but not anybody else, because their button is specific. Oh, you're not dead. Okay, now you're dead. Wow. Fucking awesome. Alright, let's hope that we can get this guy down. I don't see us having really any problem whatsoever. Uh, look at that. Full health. Amazing. Oh, and she's now attacked twice. Oops. As a shortcut, you can press L1 to defend with all the characters at once. Defending with more characters drains EP faster. So time your guard well. Shit. Oh, you only hit three of us that time. I'm still trying to use because I am attacking all four of my people just so I can get that done. Alright, attack with you, 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 and attack with you. And the reason I'm doing that is because I want my guy to do this. Oh, man, look at that damage. Fucking awesome. Oof, he hurts though. So, it seems like some of my teammates might go down here, heal them up, just like that, pretty simple. What I do like though, is that because my character was now fighting on the right side of the screen, rather than the left side, um, my buttons did switch, whereas before, my fighting with this character here was my X button, or was my B button rather, because it, it, she was the one on the right of the group compared to my other teammate who was the woman with the tiger pelt on the left side of the group. But once I was fighting on the right side, <clears throat> it then switched where I was, or sh her attacks were based off of my X button because she was now on the left side of the group and the other woman's attacks were based off the B button, which was on the right side of the group, which to me, it, it's just an amazing concept because a lot of people, it was easier for me to grasp that rather than, okay, she's on the left side, I still have to use the B button to attack, um, et cetera, et cetera. That's, I mean, that is just me, though. If that, if that doesn't work for you, I'm sorry. Um... But I mean, as far as everything goes here, whoa, whoa, um, the way the terrain works, to me, it's, it's just fun. Um, as you can 
be there are mines that I have to chop through. I couldn't do it with my hands. What else can I do it with? Well, of course, the axe. All right. So you don't get the axe off right at the start, so you have to go and find it, which is just it, it, makes, it makes sense to me. Um. I'm gonna try to attack him and attack here. Attack, 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 attack. attack. Coolio. Where you going? Are you? Oh wow. I did not have enough time to defend. Attack. 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 This, this one is taking a lot of time to go down, but on the bright side. Ooh, no, don't attack her. I like her. But like I was saying, on the bright side, I am and she does not do as much damage. Able to block that one. Finally successfully blocked it. Ooh, I can now attack three times. Even better. But anyway, guys, it has been a little bit of time. I'm going to end it right here. Uh, if you want to see more of this game, you can either check out the next episode because I'm going to check out the rest of this game afterwards. Um, or you can go check it out yourself. Uh, please, 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 if you do like the game, go to the, le the website in the link below and go ahead and donate. Um, as far as I know, it is only out for... Uh, Windows and Linux. There isn't a download for a Mac yet, but it does support um, third-party controllers. Such as, uh, I mean third-party as in not your keyboard, so your Xbox controller, your PlayStation controllers, uh, I don't know about Wii controllers, maybe? I don't know. You can go ahead and check it out for yourself. Um, if you do donate, they will, they, I think your name will go up there on the site. It'll say that you donated, how much you donated. Um, the, you, can, you can ask for something simple, such as your name and credits. Uh, their goal is, <laughs> and I know it sounds like a lot, $1.5 million. They are... About less than a quarter of a way there. Um, in 11 days, they have raised that. Please, please, please go help them if you do like it. Um, but as always, if you want to, if you like this video, you go ahead and leave a like and a favorite. Uh, it really helps me out. Uh, if you want to, you can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, or Twitch. All three of those links will be in the description below. If you want to fund this game, uh, the a link will be in the description below. Also, if you want to download the prototype, like I said, it's not an alpha or beta. It is 100% a prototype, which I, I still can't get over. It's amazing looking. Um, the link to go donate is the same link for you to download it. But just like any other time, very grateful for you guys watching my videos. I thank you so much. And hopefully I will see you next time. Goodbye.